my name? It's Ethan. Ethan Winters. It's been three years since everything happened at the Baker House. I was looking for my wife, who disappeared. I got an email from her. She told me to come get her. And of course, that's how I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. I found Mia being held captive in a dark basement. She wasn't thinking right. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. Later on, I found out that she was infected by a special kind of mold. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote, a vaccine, anything. The people who lived there were already infected. What was left of them wasn't human. The source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Her name was Evelyn. I fought the fucked up family and was able to treat Mia's symptoms with a serum. Then Chris Redfield and his soldier buddy showed up and saved the both of us. Is that enough? I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. It's all over now. Hello, Frenzy. My name is Kate Shark, and welcome to Resident Evil Village. Now, a couple things before we get started here. Uh, first of all, back from my little hiatus while i was gone i hit 100 subscribers which is insane to me i don't think so thank you to everyone who has subscribed uh thank you for liking watching everything you guys are awesome and i appreciate each and every one of you um so there's that um so if you are new to this channel which you might be because there's a quite a few of you that just popped up all of a sudden um i have never played a resident evil game like ever uh resident evil came out so the original resident evil came out in 1996 i was nine uh so that wasn't exactly something i would have access to to play and i remember i don't remember resident evil one very well but resident evil two that cover art on that game was so fucking scary and when that came out that was 98 i believe so by then i was 11 uh yeah still scared of my own shadow. I couldn't walk down the horror aisle at the um, at the video store without wanting to pee my pants. So it's really not my scene. And zombies aren't really my thing either. Um, they, they've just never really been. I know that's kind of Resident Evil's thing is the weird virus that makes people zombies. And I, I think it's been done to death. But I chose to play this one mainly because it's all about vampires and werewolves. And that shit is my bread and butter. So um, uh, I have played a couple demos of Resident Evil before I played the Biohazard demo for Horror Wayne a few years back. I also played the demo, is it for Resident Evil 2? I don't remember which one that was. It was the original one they re-released way back in the day. Or not way back, where you had like 30 minutes to play through and see how far you could get. Um, if you want to see those, I'll put a little wherever it's going to be. So you can see those as well. But I am excited because vampires, werewolves, that's my shit. It's my jam. So I'm not going to waste more time. Let's get in and try this out. Uh, what are my bonuses? Oh, okay, that's all the concept art and stuff. I don't care. Um, okay, I don't know how controls work. I don't care. Um, I guess it doesn't matter, does it? Controls. Okay, I don't know. Anyway, I guess it'll walk me through. Uh, let's do, we'll take it easy on you, just your average difficulty. Let's just do standard. Because I'm not used to this kind of stuff. Long ago, 
a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Bat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. You better be careful, don't fuck Across with the Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, that sounds like eat a... your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. Bitch, I didn't give the you that. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Uh-oh. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Baby's got a big old hand. She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. That sounds six months old. The at the store said it was traditional. A local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. It because doesn't... she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. <laughs> she just told you to fuck yourself. I'll finish dinner. It's okay, Rose. She's fine. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. P skip photo mode. Okay. Did you say something? Nothing. I'll put her down. Okay. Uh. What the? Is that the baby? What's that on uh, Three Men and a Baby where they're one of the, is it Tom, is it Tom Selleck is reading uh, a Sports Illustrated to the baby because they don't have like kids books and he's like, it's reading about a boxing match, it's like, he had a cut over his right eye and blood was getting into it <laughs> and the other guy says, oh, 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 it's okay. There, there. It's like I said to your mom, that book's too scary for you. And uh, he says, what are you reading her? He says, it doesn't matter what I'm reading. It's the tone of voice you use. <laughs> oh, that's the bathroom. That's nice. Lovely, lovely, loving it. I have a lot of sitting areas. What the fuck is that thing? Who cares? Is this your room? 
Baby, nope. That can't be a baby's room. That's not good. I was gonna say, why aren't you running? But you got a baby in your arms. I guess you can't be doing that, huh? All Almost right. there, honey. Oh, there we go. Where's your bedroom? Oh, I see. The baby sleeps in the room with you. That's okay, I guess. Do I click? How do I put him in? Or her? Oh, put Rose to bed. Go to bed, Rose. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. Why did I turn on? Oh, shit. Now I'm running. Fuck. Me and I had another fight. I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago and she blew up at me. We finally settled down in our life in Europe and can bring Rose up properly. Uh, but I still feel like a part of me is trapped in that hellhole back in Louisiana. I know Mia doesn't like to talk about it, but can we really just forget everything and pretend it didn't happen? Shouldn't we face what happened there so we can live our lives with Rose without it hanging over heads? We owe her that much, at least. I know Mia knows this too. She, would have ex she wouldn't have exploded like that at the hospital if she didn't care. Okay, chill out everyone. Get some help, talk to a doctor. Uh, Rosemary Winters. I don't know what that means. Uh, all results show no issues. Patients in good health, results for additional fungal pathogens. Oh. Rose is fine. I should hope so. Rose's favorite toy. Uh, gun survival. It's a heavy firearm. It's not game. paranoia if they're really out to get you. Um. <laughs> oh, well, that's weird. That's a cute bridal po oh, photo. Baby, baby. There's a baby, there's a baby. I wish it could stay like this forever. Well, it can't. Okay, what have we got here? Just looking through everything. Hi, Lucy. What's all this? It's... What a weird place to put the baby. Oh, no, wait, that's their room. Never mind. I'm going back to my... was not paying attention like I normally don't. What else is new? Okay, so let's see here. What's this shit? Why do I even keep this around? Is that LSU? I should get rid of it someday. Hey! It's naughty. And today's that day. What's this? Nothing? <coughs> Gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Yeah, why would the door even... well... What a cute little house. What is this shit? What? What's this? I'm not doing that. Well, that's terrifying. What's all over here? He's medication. She's been on strict regimen ever since the the incident. No, I don't. Am I a vampire already? Oh, isn't he a werewolf? I don't know. Fuck if I know. That's what I want to be, is a werewolf. Shit's awesome. You know what's funny? As a kid growing up, everything scared me, but werewolves and vampires did not. Of all the things, that was the one thing that did not bother me. Why even bother opening the drawer if I don't need anything? Okay, can I? Okay. I might have to get a controller for this. Oh. Mia makes everything by hand, so this stuff keeps piling up. So why do you have it? What are we doing? Oh, shit. 
Is she okay? Sleeping like a, well, like a baby. Mmm, that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. What are you reaching it's for? It's chorba de lagum. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm. Local wine, too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. No sulking. You really have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- <sighs> Mia, get down. She's already been shot. Oh God, Mia! <laughs> I'm sorry, but the first shot, you should have had her on the ground. Mia. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Chris? What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! Oh, Jesus. What? Why? Go on, move! What? Wait. All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Calling. Hey, Doc. Hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I've got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about the next Thursday, 4 o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. That was the Doc. She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. Bite my head off. I hardly talk about anything else. Keep telling you it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan. You matter. You just me. What are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. Jesus Christ. Jesus. Hello, what is it? That's not making my eyes fucked up. About damn time. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not off the Fuck. What the hell happened to you? Why do you have a flashlight? Okay, let's see what we've got here. 
Uh, eliminate target, recover body, secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters, move the two Winterses to Site C for further investigation, at least two transport officers to accompany them. Okay. And useless Joy. Can I do anything with this? And I don't know. Can you crouch? I don't know. I obviously have zero expertise when it comes to... Well, you better get whatever you can off that tactical gear. Warm the fuck up. We'll follow the footprints. What could possibly go wrong? That seems like your fault. <laughs> oh God, what the fuck was that? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh, I don't like that. That can't be good. Oh, something's gonna get me. Is it my brethren? Good God! Oh God! <laughs> Hello! It's like the worst Blair Witch Project ever! Oh God, stop! Well, I don't- well... <laughs> Jesus! I'm sorry. Okay, okay. Here, I'll help you. Um, stop, stop. Oh my god, quit making horrible noises. I want to help it. Quit, 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 quit. Whew. Poor thing. I'm not loving these noises. Oh god. It's my guys. on the Goatman's Bridge. Goatman? Oh, God. Garbage. Hello, bear. Fucking shit. Oh, God, that chain scared me. This is... See, I didn't even play a demo or anything. I saw Markiplier play the first demo, I think. And then... I didn't watch any others because I wanted my reaction to all this to be... Oh god, okay. Um, as genuine as possible. Can I take some of this? I feel like I could use that. Ugh. That water is disgusting. No. I don't know why we're here, and I don't like it. I'm gonna be scared. Gum? Where's that medicine? Well, that doesn't help me at all. Oh! Why? 
I hate everything. Oh, shit. Oh, bear, fuck, you scared me, cat. <laughs> Barrett, you gotta quit. You're freaking me out. Is that a body? I don't like it. Oh god. Oh, the noises. Oh god. Let's just go in. Oh, hello, Elkhead. We know what happens in basements. I hate everything. Oh, hi, bunny. What's this? Uh. Oh. What is this? Hawkeye Jesus? Um, can we put that down? I don't want to look at that anymore. What's that? You know, I do this to myself, and I think, oh, this will be a great series. Jesus! And I think, oh, I'm so smart, I'll do this, it'll be fun, blah, blah, blah. And then I scare the shit out of myself. Oh. No, it's just a wrap. It's okay. It's cool. You know, I have to keep opening these things. There's nothing in there. Is that litter? I don't like this. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Certainly not going upstairs. I don't want to. Did all this. <sighs> Was it Dawn? Thank God. Is there anything else up here? Is it? I tried to help your friend. The game wouldn't give me the option. Well, that can't be good. Do -do 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 -do. <sighs> do these vampires go out in the day? Are they cheaters? Over here. Oh, it's a door. Oh, 
Maybe, maybe they're out. <laughs> maybe some horrible creature didn't come in and murder all them. There's weird hawk Jesus again. by the door. Wait, wait, wait. That horse is gone. Shit. Obviously not getting in there, am I? Blood lung. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. in the music. Okay, that's where it came from. It's an overturned truck. That's not good. Potatoes, juice, beer, maybe? Why can't I go through anybody's shit? Those are goat heads. That can't be good. W what happened? What's this? Graveyard workshop ceremony site. Oh, great. Just some sh freaky, what do they call it? I can't read that. Like, uh, what do they call it? Summertime or midsummer shit? What's with all the kennels? It's locked, yeah. Sounds about right. I'm gonna turn my flashlight on. Some floor should break it. Oh, I don't like that noise. I feel like I'm missing something. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. Knife. That's something. Just another. Did they just run out of the house? I heard a door open. Why does it look like there's tadpoles in there? I'm not looking at that. Fuck that. Oh, no, no. 
Too friendly. Friendly. Look. Who are you? Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down the road and shh. What's going on? Oh no. They're coming. Who? Who is? What the hell was that? Do you have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. Nice. No, why would I? Oh, thank you. Take it! Take it! Help me, it's out there. Jesus! Hey, are you listening? Hey! Go! Oh, oh, no. no. more. Someone's moving over there. anything? Okay. Uh, bullets. Treasure. Okay. Um. That wasn't fun. Oh, look at that. Um. Oh, God. That was too much for my heart. I got COVID. I have to be careful with my heart. <laughs> um. get like a, a controller or something so that way I can actually work this 
somewhat well. Not what I wanted. You can't use that here. I wasn't trying to. Well, you're not helpful at all. There's nothing in here I can use. Where did it drag me down at? Oh, wait a minute. Haha, -ha, bolt cutters. Need that. Cool. Isn't that nice and peaceful? Too bad. There's these fucking like it things everywhere. Oh, I'm gonna need so many bullets. Can I go in the river? I'm not fucking with that shit. Okay, Kuja was here. Shut up. I hear a radio. Whoa. from the other side. Of course it is. Can I go up this river? Because I've only, I've only got... Sh 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 shut up! I've only got three bullets. I really don't feel... fucking with this. I guess I have no choice. Lovely. Now listen, you guys, I'm one of you. Oh. Um. Well, they're in there. I don't want to barricade anything. sure something's in there. What was this? Oh, good. Ooh, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it! done that now I can't turn it off. Oh, oh wait. Surrounded. Damn it. Oh, fuck, um, 
control. There we go. Where we came from? No. Oh. Um. <laughs> I hear one. Oh, God. Oh, do I have? I don't have enough. Just kill me. And why aren't you? Oh, I didn't. Yeah, just kill me. Oh, lovely. Uh, start the game from the most recent save point. Let's, I think here it seems like a good place as any to stop. Uh, we got a good start. I'm gonna have to get a controller uh, for this because I am not a big fan of the uh, keyboard. I know some people prefer that, I do not. So I'm gonna have to get a uh, 
controller so I can actually work this better. Uh, but in the meantime, thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to jump down that like button if you did like it. Leave a comment down below with any other game suggestions or video ideas that you'd like to see from me. Share this channel with your friends and subscribe to the channel if you have not done so already. See other videos I've done. We'll see you all for the next one.